In phonology, syncope is the loss of one or more sounds from the interior of a word, especially the loss of an unstressed vowel. It is found both in synchronic analysis of languages and diachronics. Its opposite, whereby sounds are added, is apenthesis. A syncope rule has been identified in Tonkawa, an extinct American Indian language, whereby the second vowel of a word deletes if it is not adjacent to a consonant cluster or final consonant. Synchronic analysis Synchronic analysis studies linguistic phenomena at one moment, usually the present. In modern languages, syncope occurs in inflection, poetry, and informal speech. In inflections, in languages such as Irish, the process of inflection can cause syncope. For example, in some verbs, imir should become asterisk imirim. However, the addition of the im causes syncope and the second to last syllable vowel i is lost so imir becomes imrim. In some nouns, inus should become asterisk inis in the genitive case. However, if one looks at road signs, one finds not asterisk bail nah hin eyes, but bail nah hints. Once again as the losses of the second I, it is interesting that if the present root form in Irish is the result of diachronic syncope, there is a resistance to synchronic syncope for inflection. As a poetic device, sounds may be removed from the interior of a word as a rhetorical or poetic device, whether for embellishment or for the sake of the meter. Latin comma v, rat greater than poetic comma rash. English hast, e, ning greater than poetic hastening. English have, e, n greater than poetic heaven. English over greater than poetic o'er. English never greater than poetic ne'er. In informal speech, various sorts of colloquial reductions might be called syncope. It is also called compression. Forms such as, didn't, that are written with an apostrophe are, however, generally called contractions. English o stra lea n greater than colloquial strine English did n o t greater than di d n t English i will d ha v greater than i d v English go i n g t o greater than colloquial goner found diachronically as a historical sound change. In historical phonetics, the term syncope is often but not always limited to the loss of an unstressed vowel. Loss of have a sound Old English laugh weird greater than laughed greater than Middle English lovered greater than Modern English lord. English Worcester pronounced W stir. English Gloucester pronounced L stir. English Leicester pronounced Leicester. Loss of an unstressed vowel Latin cal I dumb greater than Italian caldo hot. Latin O C U lum greater than Italian Achio I Latin trem U le greater than Italian tremere to tremble Proto Norse um a uh, greater than Old Norse A R M R um Proto Norse Bach I greater than Old Norse B K I books Proto Germanic asterisk him I N O Z greater than Old Norse hymna heavens